A drunk driver who killed a 10-year-old boy has been released from prison only six months into his sentence. 33-year-old Ryan Jabay's blood alcohol level was four times the legal limit when he smashed into a car on 4th Street in Coeur d'Alene, killing 10-year-old Sawyer Frisbee. Jabay pleaded guilty to vehicular manslaughter last September. The judge sentenced him to 12 years in prison, but now has decided to suspend the sentence for probation. Jabay now has been released. He won't have a driver's license for one year, and he will have to spend time in residential treatment programs. But bottom line, he's out of jail. And while the victim's family hasn't commented on the release they said at his trial, they wanted to move on. It's very hard. You know, I don't, I just want to have a closure to it. So that maybe my family and I can get back to normal and do things that we used to do. First responders to the scene of the crash say it was one of the worst crashes they had ever seen. Jabay has been ordered to pay the family $6,300 in restitution.